typically now the solar is 171 the battery is running on 98 watts means it's both still charging move it closer and I'm charging the phone at the same time uh, means one of the, the batteries about to be done that's why it dropped quite a bit and now we are positive charging back up and just got this from the FedEx this is a 600 watt this is 800 watt but this is only a 256 watt hour and that's 800 watt hour so it's one third of this guy and this is EcoFlow River 2 not the Pro or Max it's the smallest one and it should be the lightest one I haven't opened it. it's the first time I'm opening this oh look, look at that ah, look how tiny this thing is tiny little tiny little baby so what I was going to do is I want to oh one the battery just done I'm going to run in the series charging this with that with fast charging and or this does have a solar port we can use the 220 watt one but if we charge this with that and that charge with the solar now we can charge that and this in the same time amazing look at that cute little baby so it was a 54 percent off a flash sale that's why i got it uh which is very cheap it was a hundred and seventy dollars or something and the reason i got this i'll come with the 28 percent look at that is i could have used my power station which is yield about the same amount of power but this does has indicators which i like about this and also can link to my bluetooth okay so both of these are done these two are done i'm going to unplug in before i do that i turn the ac ac off and pull this off and what i'm going to do next is i'm going to plug this guy into this guy so the baby one river flow versus river flow 2. river flow 2 will charge up to 970 watts fast charging with a power cord this one will charge 300 so we're getting 160 one watts from the sun and going to i plugged it in this guy plug into this guy i'm going to turn this on see what happened hopefully it don't blow up one two three We're 190, 200, 200, 300, 353 maximum, and we're pulling 339. So there's a little discrepancy. That's good. So it says 40 minutes will be fully charged. Little station up there and. EcoFlow will be fully charged at two hours. We're getting 152 from the sun. Amazing. So we basically turned this into a 1000 watt hour station. And we have one, two, three, four, four plus, oh, actually five, six plugs. That's two plugs. So six plugs and two USB, one USB C. You have basic two USB C phi usb and this is oh let's turn the dc off so that's the same dc dc output turn that off and we're good amazing amazing okay, very quickly i did some changes it's now it's linked to the app both machines linked to the app so I only allow this thing to go about 300 watt fast charging through anywhere with the AC input. Um, the solar unrestricted 110. The reason I did 300, I also limited this to 800 and say 900 something. 
I know fast charge is good, but sometimes it's bad for the battery. So I want to go as high as I can, but maybe like 80%, 90% speed, but not going the full 100% speed. So now it's running on the 300 watt charging. So we're still doing pretty good. We're at 150 watts. And it's getting it done quickly. So I'm charging. The River 2 is only take 110 watts solar. The bifocal panel out there is takes 220 watts input. So the River 2 Pro can take 220 watt maximum. So now everything River 2 Pro getting is from the solar at 220 watts or below. This only does 110. So, but I'm charging this at 300 watts where I lower from 360. So basically 300 watts pure solar charging using the AC while everything the energy get from the Pro is from the 220 watts solar. So instead of running solar straight to the River 2 getting 200 or oh, getting 110 watts into the solar 2 by itself, I plug into this in 220 then this juice 300 from here so we're basically talking about 300 watts solar for, for river 2 and 220 for river 2 pro amazing 300 watts solar charging quickly it's 100 percent charged the little baby machine and we're down to 70 so i went we went from 81 to 70 so 10 percent to charge this from 23% to 100% with solar help, with solar help. So now it's just purely, uh, well, it's good. Let me register this machine and log into my account. Turn this off. After you log into your app, you got to register this on their website to add into your account. Okay. You can just use the app and add the machine into the app. You need to go to the website and register the warranty and it's under this web address. Hey, I removed my wife's extension cable and only used the EcoFlow 2 we just got. And we have this 100 watt light on. Doesn't even take any power. Amazing. So the fan is plugged into it. We still got a USB-C output. I'm going to get a USB-C to USB-C for her. So this way she can charge it. Thanks. And she still have her power bank here. And her iPad can charge off this. The power bank can charge off this. And this Apple thing can just go away. Let me go get a USB-C to USB-C. And when this gets low, I will charge this with EcoFlow 2 Pro. 2 Pro will be charged by solar. Amazing, free energy.